Hey everyone, so welcome back. I'm currently on my way to a dispersed camping area. Got the kayak loaded up in the back. Plenty of gear, plenty of food. Should be a good time. So stay tuned guys and I'll see you when we get to camp. Alrighty guys, so I found me a spot here. This is a dispersed camping spot and uh, it's right by the water over here. I don't know if you guys can see it. There's the water. Here's my truck. And uh, I had to kind of level the truck out a little bit, but looking much better now than it was before. I am tucked back here between these trees and I'm gonna string up a tarp and hang over top. We've also got quite a bit of shade here but the tarp will provide some extra shade as well as if it rains, which there are some rain chances tonight, uh, the tarp will really come in handy. We're gonna go ahead and get the kayak out now, get the tarp set up first thing, and then we'll get everything else set up after that and uh, just kind of hang out for a little bit. Then we'll probably do some kayaking, brought my fishing rod as well, so we'll do some fishing. Should be pretty fun. I hope you guys enjoy and uh, Let's get to it. Okay, that's taken care of. Now, I've got a centronella candle and I'm gonna light it because the bugs are bad. There we go. so there's the tarp all set up as you can see I can walk under here I'm gonna try to set up all my stuff on this side we can set up the camp stove over here in this area maybe a table and chair and uh, try to stay in the shade stay as cool as we can it's still pretty warm out but finally got that set up I think I like it if it rains the good thing is we'll have a nice dry spot underneath It is time to grab something cold to drink.
Cheers, guys. Feels good to be in the shade. It's currently 12 o'clock, and uh, it's it's warming up quick. I'm just dripping sweat right now, but ain't nothing else I can do about it. It looks like it's starting to cloud up, and we might get some rain, so I'm glad I've got the tarp set up. I'm gonna relax for a bit, then we'll get the stove put together. I've got a new stove I wanna show you guys. It's, it's really cool, and uh, I'm gonna be using it on this trip. Let's take a walk around camp. So as you can see here, we've got a big mud area. But over here on this side, it's not very muddy, and where I'm parked, but as you can see, there's trash all over the place. I'm gonna pick that up soon. Just wanted to get everything set up in case it started raining. And it looks like it might. Trash everywhere. But here's where I come in at. And if you walk all the way along this, a little fire pit here, more trash. The main road is right there. And we've got kind of a little, kind of a little fishing area here. More trash. A burnt chair. I mean, look at this spot. You can see the bridge there. Wow, look at these clouds here. Check that out. That's pretty cool, guys. This is a little camp stove made by Camplux. You got your little spark buttons. You got your adjustable heat. This little toaster just slides underneath, which is really cool. And uh, you'll attach your propane hose right here, and you can run it down, sit it down on the ground or something. You can see the little burner right here, the little toaster burner, and then you got your standard regular stove burners on the sides here and here. And you got carrying handles on the sides. So you can pick it up just like this and move it wherever you need it. So I actually hear some thundering in the distance and the sun still keeps coming in and out. I would like to get out on the kayak, but I'm trying to wait and see what happens with the weather here. Well, it looks like it might rain, but I'm just gonna go for it. Let's, let's go for a quick paddle, maybe throw a line in, see if we catch something. If it starts raining, we'll just head back. Well guys, as usual, not everything goes as planned. Uh, I forgot my paddle, so I guess no kayaking on this trip, even though that was a big part of what this trip was about, was kind of, you know, getting on the kayak and exploring around. But uh, that's not gonna happen because I forgot the paddle. Yeah, I, that really sucks.
I got the life jacket, I got the fishing rod, tackle box. You would think the one thing I would remember is the paddle, but I don't know how I forgot it. Just goes to show you not everything goes as planned on these trips, guys, and that's okay. You just gotta kinda make do with what you got. So gonna hang out here, maybe fish off the bank here in a little bit. Well, let's go make a few casts, see if we can catch anything. Can't believe I forgot that paddle. The water's so muddy. So it's right about 3.30 now. Just been sitting around listening to the thunder all around me. No rain, just thunder. But I'm starting to get pretty hungry now, so I say we go ahead and get some food started. Nice ribeye steak. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of oil some salt and some pepper. Flip that over. Same thing on this side. Got two potatoes as well. We're going to cut them up and fry them.
Alrighty guys, it's time to dig in. I've got this Olipop Vintage Cola. I haven't had this one before. Ice cold. Oh yeah, that's good. Cheers guys. See what this steak looks like. I'd say it's about medium well. Mmm. Mmm. That's very tender and juicy. The potatoes are really good as well. Mm. Towards the middle, it's kind of medium rare. comes the rain.
Well, it's been a uh, wild evening. We had some serious thunderstorms come through. It didn't last. It didn't last too terribly long. After that, the sun came back out. Now it is steamy, humid, and it's hot and buggy, and I had to put pants on. Went ahead and got the fire going, mainly just to kind of keep bugs away. Got my little candle going. I tried to wear a hat to keep the bugs off of my head, but it was too hot. Got us something cold to drink here. And uh, just gonna chill out by the fire, kind of hang out till it's dark, let some of this firewood burn down. We'll crawl in the back, get the fan going, and uh, try to sleep tonight. That's what we'll try to do, but I don't know. Cheers, guys. It may be hot and steamy, but it sure is peaceful out here. No doubt about it. All right, so we made it in the back here. Managed to keep most of the bugs out, for now anyway. But uh, I got this fan going. I plan on putting some mosquito netting up to where I can keep some of this soft topper rolled up. Oh. Well guys, wish me luck. It's probably going to be a long night of trying to stay cool and keeping the bugs out. I'm going to have to get these big bright lights off before they start coming in. I'm just going to try to get to sleep. It's about 10 o'clock now. Still extremely humid. May end up turning all the lights off and cracking one of these windows or something. i got to figure something out. But uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night, guys. Good morning, everyone. So I actually managed to sleep quite a bit last night. It was definitely a little bit warm, but the fan kept me cool enough to sleep last night. It's currently 7 o'clock now, and it doesn't look like the sun's burnt through the fog yet so i'm gonna get up pretty soon get us some coffee so i'll see you guys in a bit Not a bad morning view to wake up to. 
So I've just got this uh, Duncan iced coffee. If it's warm out, I like to drink these iced coffees. It is silent out here, aside from the birds. And uh, you just hear the dew dripping off of the leaves from the trees. So peaceful. Well guys, I believe I'm gonna start packing everything up and make my way out of here. I've got quite a bit to pack up and quite a bit of trash to clean up. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started now and try to beat this sun. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Uh, the food I made last night, the steak and potatoes, it was really good. Really, really good. And had a really good time. We had some awesome thunderstorms yesterday. It was just amazing. Really relaxing. Everything's caked in mud, but uh, it was still fun nonetheless. And uh, maybe next time we'll bring a paddle and we'll do some kayaking. But anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.